Okay, so I want to do like a real quick update on uh, some of the stuff. I'll, I'm not just doing this to update whoever's watching the video. I'm doing it to update myself and these are kind of like verbal and visual. Unless I've gone blind by that point. Okay, well if I'm blind, you can hear me. So, if you're blind, you can hear me. Never mind. So some of the things I plan on uh, doing in upcoming days in the new year. And this will be funny if I'm blind. My New Year's resolution, because of. And if, and if I am blind by now, I don't get that joke because I, I didn't say what I'm pointing at. You can't even see what I'm pointing at. You blind son of a bitch. So, uh, um. Oh, and if I'm still listening, I'm not just being quiet on purpose and uh, pointing at things to make fun of you. So I get adjusted him. I, uh, what was I saying? Oh, okay. So a couple things I'm working on are the, um, uh, rotational linguistics cylindrical linguistics, whatever it was, I, whatever it was, uh, I posted the other day, whatever I called them. And, uh, rotational linguistics, that's what it was. Rotational linguistics, um, I'm talking spheres, I'm talking circles, I'm talking, uh, flat discs, you know, so it doesn't matter if you're, uh, Flat earther or a, a round earther? A rounder? If you're not if you're a flatter or you're a rounder, doesn't matter. I'm gonna have some linguistics for you. Spherical. In inversive in inversed. Inverse rotational linguistics. Um what else I got? So I've got one that's both. So this is a flat disc here. And I'm gonna have the alphabet around it in a similar fashion as to this. This this is just this is just this. Um but then I also have this here, which if you know what sports are, this is a, a sports ball, a ball for sports. You do different sports with it. And it was a basketball. When you cut a basketball in half, you get these eye. You get you find these like crazy eyeballs. Kind of crazy eyeballs. That's how you know eyeball. So it's a basketball. Cut it open, and you find some eyeballs. But uh, a lot of people don't know what you got. And, uh, put it back together and glue it. Go back together, you get a football. So, life hack. Get your Brady on. Right? Um, that's actually kind of cool. I should do a video about that. I'm doing it. So, uh, yeah. I need a football to cut open. Somebody out there buy me a football. Or just give me one out of the trash. I'm gonna find I'll find one in the trash. Give me like a week. I'll swear to I swear to God I'll find one in the trash. It's gonna be awesome. So I have a uh, flat disc rotational, so I'm gonna put it on a record player for the record, it's pink. The record player. Not the this is also pink, sorry. But uh, it also pops out into a, a sphere. So, uh, we'll get to see how rotational linguistics uh, are affected by uh, 
a, a spherical spherical modification. I don't know what you call this. I just uh, made it up and figured it out just now. I didn't even think about that before uh, I said it. So spherical mod, uh, sphere mod, the sphere mod, and uh, but uh, yeah. And then uh, what else I got? I'm doing these uh, doing some videos um, or doing some papers on uh. I'm do it. Oh, hey. Tripping. Got some uh, new alphabet linguistics. I have some new, uh, new Azazel mods. Just made that up just now. That's what I'm calling any alphabetical modification I do. Um, uh, Azazel mod. Boom. That's tight. Um, Here's another one. This one is, I'm trying to find, it's nice cold in here, it's literally it's 10 below outside. So. Sorry, it's freezing, I'm freezing, it's frozen here. You can pop circle. Okay, so the one, uh, this one here is I'm trying to, or I'm not, I'm not trying anything. I got the idea to show how after you start with A through Z and use, and use A and Z, you can't use them with each other to find them again. And you can use, uh, A through Z, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, blah, 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 all the way down to Z from A through Z or 1 through 26 or vice versa, Z through A, which would be 20, negative 26 through negative 1. But you can't use them with each other, positive and negative, I mean, to find them again. You can't use anything from the alpha, either alphabet, Ra or Envy, to find A and Z again. You have to use the regular alphabet to do it or with itself or you'd have to use the negative uh, alphabet you'd have to use raw or envy to do it with themselves not each other it's a it's a weird thing so like you can start with a through z and z through a as a reference point but once you do you, you have to keep going and looping back around i mean you don't have to you can you, you can loop back around and then subtract each letter as you go or add each letter as you go or you can just keep with the ones you have that, that equal each other when you add it to itself because two positives like so like one, a plus a or one plus one is two which is b so that's to b and then z negative z plus negative z would be negative one plus negative one which is negative two which would be y so it'd be by 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 x by z which uh, you actually get a lot but but you'd never uh, get a negative a plus negative a which is negative one plus or negative 26 plus one or negative a plus a would be negative 26 plus one that is negative y so you would get a plus negative z equals y or as y as or as y or yaz or Z or A Z, A Z. That would be A Z. A Z plus A plus negative Z equals Y would be A Z. And uh, unless you're blind, you can see R A Z. But I haven't done it yet. Oh, so you can't see because I haven't done it yet. But, uh, this is something I'm working through in my head right now that I haven't actually written on paper. This is what I plan to do. And that's crazy. Forgot what it was, but I'll watch this video. Unless I'm blind. And then I'll do that. So I'm going to make a video about that. I didn't know that until just now. This is how we do things. This is how we do it. On a Friday night, when the feeling's right. And, uh... Another project I'm working on... Are the inverted... Uh, square, square, uh, inverse square law. 
applied with the alphabet. So it's A, and then inverse square law, A, B, C, D, inverse square law, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, and you keep doing that until you get to Z. I'm going to do uh, one of those uh, for each, each letter of the alphabet. I'll do one video. Because when you start, it's just A, or A, B, A, B, C, but you keep going, you find uh, tachyonic gates and uh, other weird little patterns. And that took me forever, and, and, and I still have to do the inverse of it. And it takes forever, it's just this whole, this whole, this, this whole thing, it literally, it just never ends. And, uh, because I can go indefinitely. And, which is, I plan to do. I plan to go indefinitely, it's crazy. And this is kind of, kind of that. This is, uh, A through Z with zero. So the alphabet, so raw plus zero. Or raw zero. And, uh, I just made that up too, remember that, write that down for notes, raw zero. Because Ra is one thing, which is the alphabet A through Z, 1 through 26. But Ra 0 would be A through Z. But when you write it, it's A through M, 0, and then N through Z. Just literal exact middle point of the alphabet would be M, 0, N. And you could go 0, A, blah, 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 M, 0, N, blah, 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 Z, 0. That does acceptable. You can do no, no zeros. But a raw zero would be A through M, zero, N through Z. And that's 1 through 14, zero, and then 15 through 26. You can also do it uh, A or 1 through M or 13. Zero counts as 14, and N would be 15. So instead of, uh, so we'll start at 9. I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, it would be... 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, it would actually be starting with 9 or I. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 is 0. So 0 would be, could be 0 or 14. Um, it can also be in any, 0 can be any number. You can literally just uh, take any of these out and replace it with 0. It's completely acceptable. And we'll touch more on that in a video after I figure out what the hell I'm talking about. Um, inverse square, what I about? Like inverse square law, quantum harmonic oscillators. I I did a, I did a video about quantum harmonic oscillators a while back when I was doing the uh, I was doing this thing with a uh, uh, Skellington. Um, not like a Jack. Jack was different. Jack. I did all the Jack stuff. Anything with Jack has to that has to do with Jack is a, a reference to Shining, not. The Skellington. Any any Skellington I talk about is a reference to a Skellington, not Jack Skellington. He is a Skellington. He would he would fall under the referential Skellingtons, but he isn't when I say Skellington, I don't mean Jack. Like I don't mean Jack. So when I say Jack, I mean Johnny. Uh not Skellington, even though I'm saying Skellington. When I say Skellington, I, I don't mean Jack. I mean Skellington. Like the ones we all have. Um, oh yes, quantum harmonic oscillation. Did a video way while back. With that I even have a referential page involving cubes. Oh fuck! That's awesome. I just realized, uh, the cube. Oh my god, I did this like a year ago. It says something about... Because I did a cube, a page with cube stuff about a cube and a net, uh... Like a, a like how you'd make a dice. It's called a net. If it's all flat and you fold up, cut it out. It's like you cut out across. And, uh... What was that about? Oh, oh, quantum harmonic oscillation.
quantum harmonic oscillation. I did this video about it. Uh, oh, cube. And it references the page before it cubed, so that makes sense. Cube. Check the cubes. Cubes. That's up there. I don't know. Oh, here. Cube. So, in, use this with this new thing I just got involving quantum harmonic oscillation, which is very similar to whatever this is. I thought it was a pinata. My friend gave my very, very good, very good, very good friend gave it to me. It's not a pinata. It's a light. I'm gonna, I'm gonna clean it off and dust it off before I uh, use it. But uh, I was also thinking earlier. This is just an idea I had. So, so I haven't written this down yet. So just in case, if I'm not, if I even if I am blind, I know what I'm talking about because I saw it before I went blind. The pinata light involving quantum harmonic oscillation. It's got these things where they connect. Each connection would be a letter of the alphabet. Here's the easier one to see. Each connection is a letter of the alphabet, so it'd be like A, B, C, D, E. So each one is E or C. So it's E. It's easy. It's easy to see unless you're blind. <laughs> and uh, it looks like I. It looks like uh, eyes, right? So it looks like an eye. Looks like uh, an eye, like a italic. It's it's an italics. A little swirly eye, and there's a that's five eyes. Up, that's an I five up there, and then on the top, I see there's whatever connects the, the ones on the top. But this one here, since it's all, see how it's all red eyes. All these are all red eyes connecting to each other. Yeah, there's five of them though. One, two, three, four, five, and then the five in the middle. So that's like that's a, that's an I five. It looks like a red eye. So if I was to, <laughs> if, I was to hold on, if I was to do this. <laughs> I'm do this here. Oh, and or look like and, a uh, Sorry, it's fake. And now I need to hold this here for a second. I can too. I can do this. Here's what I do. Film this. So actually, I'm I'm from the future. Okay. I'm gonna take here this and make it a mouth. And sure. then we're gonna take this. And we're gonna film it. This red eye here. Oh, there's two of them. Whoa, there's two red eyes. Okay, that's crazy. Why wouldn't there be? So red eye. If I was to cut this in half, I'm gonna spin. I'm gonna spin it. Keep, I'm gonna keep this one here. On my left. My left. This is my left. It's your right, but it might be my left or your left and my right depends. And then I'm gonna spin it. I'm gonna keep this one here. There's gonna be a cut because I'm gonna take it and do this. To the other side, so, but uh, but even I'm mean, just explaining what I'm going to do so it doesn't look like I'm lying because I'm not lying. So, so th there's going to be a cut, but I'm going to keep holding it. So here's one red eye, and I'm just going to keep holding it here. There's going to be a cut because I'm spinning it. I don't want to lie to you. I'll tell you what I'm doing as I do it. Even if you can't see it, this is what I'm doing. I'm spinning it around to the other side where that other. There it is. Oh, where was it? Fuck. Okay, so there's one here. And one here, see? So I'm that way you know I'm not lying. There's one here and one there. See what the middle looks like all the way around. As you can tell this one's kind of kind of cracked here, so that that way you know I'm not lying. So so there's one red eye, and here's the second red eye. I'm gonna hold this one here. Now there's gonna be a cut, but I'm gonna keep going and I'm gonna go to the broken one. But now that you know there's a broken one, you know I'm not lying. And you can see that's one, two, one, two, three, four, five. So that's another red eye because it connects here like a ocular, ocular. Where the fuck that? There's things. Look it up. Now I'm gonna hold this one here, and I'm gonna go back. To, I'm gonna hold this one here for a second. Hold on. I'm looking at the other eyeball. You can't. I. I. I, I wasn't. But I will be in the video right now. Because. Because I'll, I'll have already spun it, which. Which I just did because there'll, there'll be a cut. There'll be a cut. You'll see the cut. And that doesn't mean I'm editing things or... I am editing, but, but not, not to trick you or fool you. It's just that I can only like explain to you. Unless I film this and then film myself editing it and then showed you that video instead of this video that I've edited and filmed. But yes, it'll look like a mouth. And, or it'll look like a face. Sorry, it's a face. And now I need to hold this here for a second actually too. I could do this. Uh, so actually, I'm I'm from the future. I was brought back here to show you 
uh, a mouth that's a little bit longer and then be like, hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo, I was gonna cut it open, but I didn't. But I'm from the future, even though you're watching this in the past. Thank you.